Taking your big man. Alrighty, currently headed to Tyler's. I'm gonna go to the junkyard, but oh, this time I know, I know I was about to say hopefully. I was about to say hopefully it's not gonna be too hot. But I don't think it's gonna get that hot. Not today, but um, as you can tell by the color of the trees, it's fall. Me and Tyler talked about coming back in the fall when it wasn't scorching hot, so we didn't get like heat stroke. If you guys remember the last video, if you haven't, the uh, car will be up in the top right corner to watch the other junkyard video. But this time we're going to do some more exploring. See if there's any new Mustangs in there and see what kind of new parts we can grab. There's Big Daddy. Gotta get some cashola for the junkyard. Twix has ice cream now. They've had ice cream. Really? Yeah. Be nice if they have more Mustangs in this time. Yeah, too bad we don't. Stop being, af stop being afraid of the chickens. I don't like roosters. Oh my, hey, there's a hood for you. Let's paint yours like that, Tyler. Yeah, that. <laughs> nice. Oh. We, we can get you a motor swap in there. How much do you think they'd want for that apple? 20 bucks. 20 bucks? Yeah. Seems about right. Oh, there's somewhere here. Cool packs. Yeah, that looks like my same. That looks like your fuel row, actually, doesn't it? Yeah, it's the same. Uh, the VIX and the uh, whatever this is, this is the Grand, whatever Marquis, however you say it. Same thing, but um. They have all the cool packs over here on this side. Huh. Here's a here's a tube valve half torn apart. Nah, uh, it barely has anything in it. What's this one have? No. Uh -oh. This one's like. Untouched. Yeah. This one. Besides the alternators going. Yeah. Usually my cool packs are like yellow. Those are black. But I guess they're the Mine same were thing. black. Were they? Yeah, the stock GT ones were black. Huh. They're 10 mils to get out. Well, I don't know about Crown Vicks, but. I sure, I sure brought my uh, screwdriver that might actually fit it. Ah, uh, the graveyard of new edges. Yo, there's a nice center console there too. Where's the aftermarket alarm at? I've never seen anything like that on a Mustang. Not either. No buttons? Nice. Nice. Uh, Was it a Maryland sticker? Maryland only gets inspected one time. Not a bad looking dash in here. I found some they've been wanting. Of course, this one has to be sanded down, but I guess it didn't really match, anyways. <laughs> but um, I can probably spray paint them for now. But it's perfect. Both of them's on here. I didn't break any montas. This is already broken. Oh, okay. it's already half loose. I was about to say I did that good. Then. Yeah, it just broke all but two tabs. But it's no big deal. I'm actually really excited about those. I've been looking for something like that for a while. And every time I find them online, people like want like 150 bucks for them. Okay. But it's, what happened is they changed them in 2001 and up because the GTs in prior to 99 to 2000 had the ones that have on my car now. A lot, that's why a lot of people thought my car was a six cylinder in my one video. Hmm. You can call my car a six cylinder because I took the fog lights out where they weren't taken out. They were blacking out so they couldn't see them. Yeah. And I had those uh, side scoops on it and everybody kept thinking that my car was a six cylinder but Kept telling me it was a GT, then he said, well, it was a VH swap. A lot of them, I guess, had newer ones and didn't know better. But they look good, though. I think that's their personal truck. I don't think so. I think it is. It says Elwood. <laughs> it literally says Elwood's on it. <laughs> that's nice. Hi, oh, puppy. How does uh, follow him later? Murder three valve. That's clean. I kind of like the wheels on it, too. So we're gonna see if my uh, screwdriver end will fit these cool packs. I got one of those cheap AutoZone that doesn't definitely doesn't have any cool packs in it. Alrighty, we'll see what we can do with this one, I guess. Fingers crossed we can get these cool packs out. He needs, uh, how do you mean, you need like two, right? Yeah. And I need one, because I have one cheap AutoZone cool pack. And before I get my car dyno tuned, my guy that does dyno tuning, he says you have to have Ford OEM, I will not tune otherwise. So I need one, unfortunately. 
But I would assume the Vic motors, which is practically a Vic, but it's a Mercury. But same thing, it's a two valve. But minor differences. I think these are non PI, that's the only difference. Moment of truth. I'll hold on to that. Fit? No. Well, maybe if you beat the fuck out of it. No. Ah, oh, fuck. We really should have brought some tools. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck we were thinking. Is that an El Camino? Yeah, okay, I was right there. I just called him Grand Marquise and. How do you say it, Marque I don't know Marquise? how to Marquise, that's how you say it. it. sounds so weird. It's such a weird name, but yeah. I think that is a Pinto, isn't it? I think so. Oof. Man, all these classics just getting destroyed. Mmm. Let's see what we got. That one's a V8. I think that would be a 5.4, though. Probably. Just by looking at the body style. Yeah. The cool pack sh might be the that's same. Right 5.4 Triton, but it almost looks just like, dude, those cool packs are actually the same, I think. Look at them. They literally look the same. Mm -hmm. The heads look the same, too. The 5.4 5 is not much different than the 2 valve. They actually make the same horsepower. For all the tension, guys, here's where the tensions go to die, too. What's this got? The hood's nice, I think. I need a hood with a decent paint job on it. Eh, I might be able to break, be brought back. It's got like the little blue fade around there. I don't know if they can be brought back or not. What's this, what's this have? Is it, oh, this is the 4.2 also. All right, so I guess we'll um grab this piece. Then the pieces are under there that I wanted. There's nothing else in here at all that I could use, honestly. Unfortunately. Already got this piece. I have ideas for this yet. You don't know yet, but it'll be different. Probably a little bit rice, but different. 94. No, that's out of a newer one. And we got these uh, bad boys. The uh, Cobra slash GT side scoops I've been looking for for some quite some time. It's walking towards us. Yeah. <laughs> I'm terrified. Those side scoops are going to look a lot better. I'm going to paint match to red, too. Coming to get some supplies for... The side louver is going to try to get some somewhat matching paint for now. Nothing major. I mean, it's not going to match perfect. Alrighty, guys. So, this is what we found from the junkyard. Uh, I like to call them Cobra um, side scoops, but I know there's GT side scoops. Cobra and GT have the same thing. But I'm going to end the video off here. And in the next video, you will notice what I'm going to be doing with this. You're probably curious what I'm going to do with this uh, center console lid. But yeah, I'm about to prep these up. And uh, yeah, and, you, and it, like I said, in the next video, you'll know what I'm going to be doing with that. Um, Got the uh, newer side scoops. I've been wanting these for a long, long while. I've been trying to find a good set used online on Facebook, but I didn't feel like paying new because I don't know. I just don't feel like paying that much money for side scoops. But I got all this for 30 bucks, and this these two were technically 20 for the both. So. I'd say that's pretty much a steal. Alrighty guys, if you want to see more junkyard content, think about finding some other junkyards that we can walk through. So leave a like and leave a comment. Let me know if some of your cool uh, junkyard finds. Let me know down in the comments uh, what you found pretty cool in the junkyard, what kind of deals you've gotten. Give me some motivation to go back and do some more hunting. But yeah, what I really want to find is some more like Cobra style parts, but that's going to be rare and a really, really, um, you know, hard thing to do because, you know, there's not going to be many Cobra parts in the junkyard. And if there were, were are, they're probably not going to be there. Probably already going to be taken. Buddy guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and see you guys later. And we can Better